Guru Purnima event at Thrissur School sparks grow after pic of Muslim girls touching teachers feed goes viral an event for celebrating the occasion of Guru Purnima has landed CNN Girls Higher Secondary School in Thrissur in trouble after photograph of Muslim girls touching the feet of teachers went viral on social media. The youth wing of the Indian Union Muslim League, the Muslim Youth League, has criticized the incident and has reportedly written to the state education minister, asking for a probe in the issue, Thrissur. Guru Purnima celebrations at a higher secondary school at Cherpu and Thrissur have sparked a row after activists raised concerns regarding the inclusion of students belonging to a minority religion in the ceremony. The incident took place at CNN Girls Higher Secondary School, which had organized an event to honor teachers on the occasion of Guru Purnima, as per an Indian Express report, in a photograph of the event which later went viral on social media, Muslim girls could be seen paying respect to a teacher by touching his feet and offering flowers at his feet. The youth wing of the Indian Union Muslim League, the Muslim Youth League, has criticized the incident and has reportedly written to the state education minister, asking for a probe in the issue, condemning the incident. The Muslim Youth League State General Secretary P.K. Firoz said that such a practice where students from other religions and non-believers were compelled to follow the rituals of a particular religion was unconstitutional and an infringement of personal liberty, the Daily reported. Meanwhile, Shami P.A., a social activist in chair who also seconded Firo's opinion, saying that it was not fair on the part of the school authorities to ask children from other religions to participate in Hindu rituals. He told the Daily, it is not fair to include students from other religions in the Hindu practices. The students will definitely be afraid to express their opposition to it. He also noted that the educational institutions under the state government have to be free from religious practices. Congress MLA VT Balram also slammed that move by the school authorities over the incident. In a Facebook post, Balram said that the knowledge imparted by teachers were not a generosity anymore as they were being paid for it. He wrote, education is the right of the child. It is being imparted by the state government. It is not wrong to appreciate a good teacher, but the practice of touching the feet and making students bend in front of the teachers should be questioned. On the other hand, E. Balagopalan, the manager of the century-old school, has denied the allegations that students were compelled to participate in the celebrations and to follow a particular practice. Orbiterworld.org Cycling with Auntie Annie Orbiterworld.org Undo Sponsored Links Sponsored Links Promoted Links Promoted Links You may like Woka Story Babysitter Hears Noise Upstairs So Dad Checks Hidden Camera Woka Story on the Golf Trends Heartbreaking photos North Korea doesn't want you to see golf trends to Rondo sponsored links sponsored links promoted links promoted links history saint final photo what happens next is insane and horrifying history saint Rondo sponsored links sponsored links promoted links promoted links recommended for your TS PMO about 15 lakh rupees promised by PM Narendra Modi Here's the reply Undo X Big Boss contestant Gazale Thackrell goes the Mandakini way, dons a wet suri and raises the temperature Undo Forge of Empires, free online game, must play city building game this summer Forge of Empires, free online game Undo sponsored links sponsored links promoted links promoted links.